When a breast cancer patient comes to visit me before they start chemotherapy, these are the things I tell them about the differences between a medical wig and a fashion wig. There's a huge difference between a fashion wig and a medical wig. Sometimes a medical wig is called a cranial prosthesis. Fashion wigs are fine for lots of people and lots of things, but they're called fashion because they were created to change your look and to change the fashion of your hair. Most of them are made with different materials and the insides are not very comfortable for women who have lost their hair due to chemotherapy. Most cancer patients, especially breast cancer patients, who have lost their hair, their scalps are very tender. Their head is very, very um, tender when they put something on it. So the inside of a medical wig is made where the inside of the wig is lined and it's soft. It fits their head better. When they move their head, the wig doesn't move. When they pull their hair back, they have an invisible hairline, so it looks like their own hair is growing out of their scalp. They're able to comb the hair, wear the hair, and look good in the hair and feel confident while they're wearing it. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.